This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Let's get right into the news. Okay, so first off, we got XXX Tentacion. His half brother is taking his own mother to court. I don't know if it's his mother or if it's his on his father's side half brother, but he's accusing the mother of XXX Tentacion of stealing Jody Cavani. The mother of XXX's half brother, Corey Patrick, claims XXX's mom, Cleopatra Bernard. Okay, there we go. Connected a plan to siphon millions of dollars of her own son's trust money um, set aside for that was set aside for Corey, according to legal documents. How did X know to set up a trust at such a young age? That's pretty interesting. Um, Jody, uh, he wants Jody, who is uh, oh she okay, so she is going at ex's mom Cleopatra on behalf of Corey. Says uh, that he left behind assets in trust to Corey as of one of three beneficiaries. She claims that Cleopatra, let's see, fifty percent to Cleopatra, twenty, which is his mom, and then twenty five percent to his brother. Alden with Corey getting the remaining 25%. But in the, the whole court documents, Jody claims Cleopatra cut a deal with X's baby mom, which helped her get Corey out of his portion of the estate. It was improperly transferred, they say. Jody wants $11 million in damages uh, and may try to triple that amount. That's crazy. Let's see. Uh, they originally sent an advance letter, and it was ignored. So we'll see what happens with that. This is nasty. This is where money gets nasty, uh, especially after someone passes. Then we got, unfortunately, Hurricane Chris. He was arrested, uh, second degree, taking somebody out. Um, so apparently, that was, so this happened in Shreveport, Shreveport Louisiana. Um, charged with second degree in a legal possession of stolen things following a dispute at a Texaco gas station. Uh, Chris told them he popped the guy that thought was trying to steal his vehicle. Officer invest, invest, investigated the incident, however, claimed the video footage obtained shows that Chris did not act in self defense. And said the car, uh, law enforcement also said that the car Chris was in did not even belong to him. It was reported actually taken in Texas. So he was driving a car that was taken. Jeez. Hey, bay, bay. I like Hurricane Chris, though. I've met him before. He's a nice guy. But uh, this is a little weird. But maybe he was under the influence? I don't know. But anyways... This is Jordan Tower with JT News. I hope you guys are having a great day. Stay positive, keep the bad energy away, and keep focused on your goals. I'll check you guys in the next one.